Hello, everybody! I am Moldy Worlds, and this is Dark Souls 2 once again. And we are going down into the Bloom Tower, and it's finally time that I came back to this game. I just took a little break from it as all. I wasn't gonna abandon the series, I gotta finish what I started. But in order to do that, I needed to take a little break so I could come back refreshed. I'm going to be putting Valdis' story on hold, though, until I finish this or something. And I've already got something lined up that I will plan on playing after I finish Yotun. But that's a story for another day. We will discuss that when the time comes. And today's also the day that Monster Hunter World was released, and I just managed to tear myself away from that game long enough to record some of this. So, without further ado, I now jump off, possibly to my death. Wee! Alright. Not death. Good. Not death is very good. Oh, I'll show you a nice job. It involves jumping down there and dying instantly, which I'm not gonna do. So no, sir, I will not do a nice job. Oh yeah, I remember. There's guys gonna be coming out of the ash. Yep, there's one right now. I just needed a time of my moment to remember that, and hot damn, these guys are weak. Either that, or I'm just really strong. <laughs> I do work out. Not really, though. I don't work out at all. The only exercise I get comes from my jab. Running around pushing carts in the parking lot all day does build a bit of muscle on ya. Hey, ow. They also do a lot of damage. Oh, ball sack. I should not have stood there. No, I should not have. I should have moved before trying to heal. That's my fault. I haven't gone down this way, though. What is down this way? There was a message back there saying ring ahead. And he was not lying. Because that's all that's here. Just a ring. And a dead guy. And my foot seems to be stuck in his body. You like my foot? Do you like having it inside your leg? Because you shouldn't. Because that's weird. I'm not sure why I didn't grab this the first time. It was sitting right there and I guess I just didn't notice it. My mind seems to be going. That ain't a good sign when your mind leaves your body like that. I'll take that and I will kill you before you get a chance to kill me. All right, now he ain't gonna get murdered by double axe guys. These double axe guys are gonna get murdered by me if I could move. There we go, I probably should have waited, all right. No, I shouldn't have, that was the perfect time. You gotta have the good timing like I do if you wanna live in this world. Oh yeah, timing is everything in this game. Oh, I saw that. You ain't ambushing me, because I ambush you with a friggin' lightning blade! What is this, though? Rogue water. Probably not good, but probably very good. I don't even know what I'm saying anymore. That seems to be something that I say a lot while I record. I just say something that I don't even know what I'm talking about, and then I just point out that I don't know what I'm talking about to make myself look even stupider for the sake of entertainment. And then it's just the truth, though, and I did not want to climb the ladder. Get back up there! I want to... No! Oh, the message! I want to read the message! Read it. Item ahead. Okay, that was not worth the struggle of getting on the ladder twice. But at least there was an item. For that I thank you, message man. You did not lie to me. I respect honesty. I require honesty. I found a scythe with honesty. This is probably a trap. Nope, was not a trap. Damn. I wanted to get trapped, because that would make it more interesting. Hmm. All right. Not a mimic, but is it trapped? Damn it, where are all the traps? I want to get hit with a trap. 
I like traps. Hmm. I know traps can be very bad and lead to an untimely demise, but I like them anyway. And I'm going to smelter wedge you right in the belly button. There we go, and now I'm getting swarmed by guys. All right. I think that thing was also spawning them for making them very resilient. One of those two, and I'm dead. <laughs> All right, now you give me my blood and you don't go ambushing me, all right? All right, get up that ladder and be quick about it! Oh, damn, I took a hit. That is not what I wanted. But I do have a plan. A plan of attack that might work, but it might not. It might backfire horribly, but I think it's worth a shot. And we're in the silver cat ring, so fall damage will be reduced some... And if you just stay right there, I can do this to you! Yeah, bitch! One shot and you're dead! Now, I hope I'm not about to be hit, because I am totally about to be hit. Alright. Alright, good. Not hit. Not dead. Everything's coming up moldy. And normally that ain't a good thing, but when it's moldy west you're talking about, then the moldiness is great. Because west is the best kind of mold you can have. Only when it grows on the west wall, but never in any other direction. Especially east. Fuck that direction. East is not good. East is evil. Oh, how did I not even notice you? God damn it, lock on! Why didn't you lock on the first time I hold you lock on? Is because the camera got stuck behind some stupid pillar? Is that it? You fucking up my lock ons, pillar! I can't be having you fucking up my lock ons. Eh. Suffer my wrath. Booyah, motherfucker! My wrath is not to be scorned. It is not to be laughed at. For it is my wrath that will be your end. Now, let's see if I made a horrible mistake just now by pulling this lever. And... Alright. Relatively safe. Blood stain on the ground. That's very foreboding. Hmm. Oh! What the fuck was that? Uh, oh, there's a guy up there. He just chucked something at me. I do not appreciate having things chucked at me, sir. If you're going to attack me, come down and fight me like a man. Nothing to do back over there, though. That's just a drop to death. Can't be dropping to my death. That would be bad. Hmm. It also would be bad if I get stabbed and sliced open with axes and swords. But I'd rather take my chances with swords and axes. And I forgot about these guys. They have barrels that explode. Yeah, you go running into that fire like a moron. Yeah, do it. Go, get in there. There it is! Ha ha! I ain't stupid. I ain't going to physically attack you with a sword. I am smarter than that. Arrows will be your downfall. Ho ho, another one falls. Just for the fuck of it, I'm gonna hit you with my sword. And, all right, he didn't explode because I'm not using fire. Good. Good. And there's one of those fire-breathing bullhead statues from, from, from the Iron Keep. But at least there ain't much more of those around here. Or are there? There's that guy who's taking a lot of damage by stepping in fire. I like your stupidity. Your stupidity is good for me. You big weirdo who's got the floating bow. Okay. It was one of those guys that shot at me earlier. And I thought he threw a spear or something. Oh, he did. That's what happens when you pay no attention to where you're going. I always pay attention to where I'm going, even though I totally don't and I am a very stupid person. You should heed my advice. Stupidity is best. You should just go running into fire. That's good for me, but not for you, because you're stupid. And I don't gotta be, well, okay, I do gotta be wary of ambush. I do gotta be wary of ambush, because there's barrel guys who are going to run into fire and try to blow me up. Yeah. If memory serves, and it usually does, there's a room somewhere in this place that's just 
full of those guys. If I were to shoot a fire arrow in there and hit one of them, it would clear the place out with, in under a second, just kaboom, everyone dies, the end, and I can move on in a sniper spot. Yes, but what exactly would I be sniping here? Probably that guy. That seems like a good idea. I don't want to get my blade dirty, now do I? Have an arrow to the head, courtesy of me, Moldy West. Yeah, you like getting shot in the head, don't you? Where are you going? Right in the knee! The good old 2011 joke, because that's when Skyrim came out. It's actually been that many years. It's 2018 now. How many years is that? 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, seven years! Skyrim originally came out seven years ago. God damn, I feel old! Even though I was in high school then. And now I'm just a no-life adult sitting in his room yelling at a webcam while playing video games, and I push carts in a parking lot for a money so that I can actually feed myself and my parents and younger brother because I live with my parents and we've always been struggling with money. But now that I have a job, things have actually been a bit easier. Booyah! There we go. And now it's your turn, Mr. Halberd-wielding douchebag guy. You are going to regret throwing that firebomb at me, because I'm going to slip around and poke you in the butt right there, right betwixt thine cheeks. That is the goodness, once you get the blade between your cheeks. All right, it's not a mimic. Good. It's always a good day when you don't find a mimic. Am I going to get ambushed? Nope, it's a bonfire. Good. I don't really have that great of a memory of the Broom Tower. I only went through it like once back when the DLC for the original Dark Souls 2 first came out. And then I think I might have gone through it on Scholar of the First Sin when I first got the PS4. It's been so long now, it's hard to remember. And I do not have enough souls to level up. I like having enough souls to level up. But I don't like not having enough souls to level up, because not being able to level up is not good for my abilities to level up. Oh yeah, not a mimic, that's good. You wanna open that chest sometime? That'd be good. Give me the chest, twinkling tight night. You can't hit me. But can I shoot a smaller arrow through the bars and hit that thing and make it rotate and spit fire on you? No, I can't. Ow! He shot above the thing! You cheater with your disembodied arm, what the... Oh. Somebody's stupid, somebody's dumb! Alright, I think this ought to lead into that room that I was just looking into. Or maybe a different room. It is indeed a different room. My suspicions have lied to me once again. And they say you can always trust that feeling in your gut. And it's not a good idea and that guy's shoulder barfs lava. That much I do remember. Big ass guys with lava that occasionally falls out of their shoulder. They got big ass metal things that they hit people with. And it's the only way I can go. Cause the elevators ain't working yet cause I haven't turned them on. I haven't gotten out in there and turned them on. I gotta get in there. And. Pyromancy and hurrah for door. Hmm. I don't have pyromancy, but that guy just dropped like a dumbass. Hmm. I see you laying there. You're gonna assemble yourself and try to murder me, aren't you? But not if I murder you first, and I can't seem to murder you. Damn. His deception is too strong! I cannot penetrate it with my blade! Stay calm, but control. Okay. I'm watching you! And I should probably be watching where I'm going, that would be a better idea. Hmm, do I have, uh, any fire arrows or something of that nature? That is something that I would like to know. Fire great arrow. Fire arrow, there we go. Yeah, bitch. 
You gonna get fire a road and I should probably not stand close to them. Get out of the way, spirit man! I need to see what I'm doing! Booyah! There we go. That's how you clear a room. That's how you clear a room. What are you? Life gem. Good. And I'm out of time for this episode. So, in the next one, we're going down there. Probably going to die, because that's what happens in this game. You die. A lot. You just die, and you die, and you die. Unless you're good at it. And I'm sorta good, but I'm not great. But, what am I even talking about right now? I gotta end the episode. Thank you all so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed watching, and I hope to see you again in the next one. Bye!